Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to download Lenovo ThinkPad uh, model T490S and X390. So this versions should work on Windows 10 1709 through 1909. I'm going to um, go to the very top one, which is 1909. If you are running 1909, so if you have Windows 10 1909, you need to download this versions. And if you have 1809, you can download this versions. So I'm going to download 1809. I'm sorry, 1909. Which is the um, the date here is March 01, March the first. So which is which is brand new. Look like this is really similar versions of um, drivers. So I'm going to download this one. So it's downloading the EXE. It's the size is 418, uh, 414 megs. All right, look like the EXE has been downloaded. I'm going to extract it by double click on it. Let me minimize the screen. I'm going to extract it to my network share. except so it's going to be putting on my network share drivers i'm going to call this lenovo t490s and x390 So I'm going to put it here. Extract. Oops. This folder already exists. I probably have going to have to download it to a network share first. I mean, to um, locally on the computer. All right, let's see. Let's do this. I'm just going to put it here. Temp. Extract. This will extract the exe. All right, so the file has been extracted. I click finish, and I'm going to copy the uh, contents. And put it on the network share. All right, so now it has been copied down to my network share. I'm going to rename this for Windows Win 10 1909. 
versions. Once that's done, I can import it to Configuration Manager. Let's go to Import, Driver Package. I'm sorry, go to drive, Drivers and then go to Import Drivers. Source Files, just copy and paste. Click Next. I'm going to select all these drivers by default and create a new categories. The categories would be the model, the model and the operating system, uh, Windows 10 operating system versions. Oops. Contain a quarter comma semicolon underscore. It does not allow underscore. That's um, maybe it does not allow space. Oh, it does. There's no space here. Maybe dash would work. Yeah, so you have to remove underscore and replace it with dash. Click OK. Next, it's going to be a new package. Let's make this capital letter. Manufacturing and model, driver models. I can just put in <clears throat> oops. The path, I'm going to put it in here. Let's create a new folder. Package. Click OK. Next. At this time, I don't think I need to add it to MDT uh, to um, boot, boot image or boot files. If Pixie doesn't work, <clears throat> then I can add the network drivers only to uh, boot file. Next, so it's going to create the package for me. All right, look like it is um, successful. I'm going to close this out. Let's go back to, let's go to the driver package. Here it is. I'm going to the, distribute the content to the DP. Choose the DP. And I'm going to update my test sequence. Going to choose limit drivers and choose this one and click apply. So that's it. That's how you, um, I should change this to, I'll just leave it. So now when I image my machine with the T40, T490S and X390 on Windows 1909 or Windows 10 1909, the driver should automatically apply to the operating systems. I'm going to click OK. And I'm not going through the, the uh, task sequence process since um, I don't have the physical model with me right now. This is just the the uh, the process of um, importing uh, downloading and importing drivers 
thank you for watching and if you like the video please don't forget to subscribe and have a great day